This is an English guide to learn Swedish. Welcome back. Now that you know some basic about the alphabet, it's time to look more closely on every individual letter, because I was very brief in my previous video when it came to pronunciations. So today I will start off with the first letter, A, and end with the last one, Ö. On every letter I will start by stating its name, then its pronunciation. If it's a vowel, I start with a long vowel first and then a short vowel. Then I say how common the letter is in the Swedish language, using the grades very common, common, not common, uncommon, and rare. After that I will take two word examples, just so you can hear the letter in action. If it's a vowel, try to figure out if it's a long or short vowel. Lastly, I give you some fun fact if I can come up with any. Let's start. A. 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 A is a very common letter. Ask. Jag. If a word starts with A, it almost always has the short vowel pronunciation. B. B. B is not a common letter. Bar. Tub. C. S. K. C is not a common letter. Cykel. Akne. Café. C can be pronounced as S or K. And a couple of other ways that I will talk about in a later episode. D. D. D is a common letter. Dyr. Id. D is in some instances a silent letter, which I also will talk about in later episodes. E. 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 E is a very common letter. Ek. Grepp. The pronunciation of the short vowel for E and E is the same. F. F. F is not a common letter. Fisk. Alf. G. G. G is a common letter. Groda. Öga. G is sometimes pronounced as J and sometimes it's silent. H. H is a common letter. Hal. Yuhu. H is sometimes silent. I. 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 I is a common letter. Is. Fisk. I on its own is a Swedish word which means in or within. J. J. J is an uncommon letter. Jul. Pai. J causes preceding D's, H and G's to become silent. K. K. K is a common letter. Kai. Jak. L. L. L is a common letter. Lot, tall. M. M. M is a common letter. Mat, tom. N. N. N is a very common letter. Not, torn. O. O. O is a common letter. Orre. Mot. O is sometimes pronounced as long O, as in kol. P. P. P is not a common letter. Par. Rap. Q. K. Q is a rare letter. Kvagga. 
Blomqvist. Q was sometimes used instead of K in ye olden days and lives on in last names. R. R. R is a very common letter. Ratt är art. R is the trickiest letter to pronunciate. It's hard to describe how you do, but place your tongue just behind your incisors and try to make your tongue vibrate by exhale slowly. Sometimes, as in art, R is more similar to English and you don't articulate it that well. S S is a common letter. Sak. Bas. T. T. T is a very common letter. Tak. Stå. U. 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 U is not a common letter. Ulv. Hus. V. V. V is a common letter. Vad, liv, dubbelv, v. W is a rare letter. Vuk, bovling. W is only used in names or loan words from English. X, x. X is an uncommon letter. Xylophon, yxa. I. I. Y. I is an uncommon letter. Yxa. Rysk. Z. S. Z is a rare letter. Zebra. Och son. Z is pronounced as an S. O. O. O is not a common letter. Åsna. Måste. O on its own is a Swedish word, which means river. Ä. 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 Ä is a common letter. Äta. Päls. Ö. 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 Ö is not a common letter. Öga. Söla. Ö on its own is a Swedish word which means island. After this we can conclude that ö i å means island in river. Before I end this episode, let's take the vowels once more. A. A. E. E. I. I. O. O. U. I, I, O, O, Ä, Ä, Ö, Ö. Next time I will talk about when you should use the short or long vowel. Thank you for watching.